Hi, Trevor here with Running Warehouse with this week's vlog where we have a nice lightweight trainer story from Puma, Saucony, and rounding out Montreal. But first up from Puma, um, they have a new line out called the Foss Line. And what it is is they have a number series. And the smaller the number, the more performance oriented it is on the Foss cushioning scale. And these are all neutral designed shoes. Well, the first up from here is the Foss 500. It offers a nice, breathable mesh with a synthetic suede upper. Really comfortable. Uh, the midsole offers a nice natural ride through their BioRide technology. This is a really cool shoe. Uh, I'm really excited about this. Again, this is the Foss 500. And getting a little more down the scale on lighter end, we have the Foss 300. This is a go fast. Um, lightweight shoe. You can use this for your tempos, intervals, racing, or maybe you're more of the uh, minimalist runner. Uh, this is a great option for you on your daily runs. This is the 300 Foss from Puma. Well, getting even lower, we have the Foss 250. Uh, it uses the same platform as a 300, except it uses a lightweight, really breathable mesh upper, uh, really flexible, um, can carry you through everything from a 5K, but has, still has that cushion to get you through a marathon as a racer. Great option, this is the Foss 250. Well, staying with Puma, but moving into the complete series, we have the Fujin. Uh, this is a nice lightweight racer, uh, really keeps you low to the ground, really flexible, has a nice platform allowing a nice natural ride, a little closer to heel-toe ratio, will give you that quick leg turnover. Uh, what's really nice about the Fujin is you can use it for those 5K races all the way up to the marathon. Um, it still gives you that plenty of cushion to get you through. This is the Fujin from Puma. Well, it's big brother is the Rygen. Uh, it offers a little more through that midsole. Um, great lightweight daily trainer. A uh, great complement to the Fujin. Uh, again, nice upper, a uh, lot of breathability in there. Um, you can do it for, you can use this for your tempo runs or intervals. Like I said, daily training. Uh, maybe even wanted to race it in it. Um, this is the Rygen from Puma. Well, moving on to Sockney. We have the anticipated Mirage, uh, similar to a Convara. It offers a nice post on that medial side. Uh, again, nice uh, close heel-toe ratio. Really exceptional for those mid-foot, four-foot strikers. Great responsive ride. Um, really nice color options. This is the Mirage from Sockney. Well. Getting a little faster, need something a little more lickety split, we have the Fast Twitch 5. This is a great racing option, again, for those 5Ks, maybe the marathons. It has a nice post on that medial side for your runners, a little over pronators, give you that extra support that you need. Um, nice upper, really keeps that foot nice and secure in there. This is the Fast Twitch 5 from Saucony. Well, moving to the trail aspect from Saucony, we have the Peregrine. Um, it offers a little closer ratio in the heel toe, uh, more so than your traditional trail shoes. The result is a nice low to the ground platform, really keeping it nice and stable. Um, this is a great option for you trail runners, maybe looking to really be light and quick on your feet on the trails. The Paragrand is your choice. Uh, you can use it for racing, for those daily training. Great option for you neutral runners. Um, nice little special thing they do is the EVA pads on the upper against lace bite, aggressive outsole traction, has a rock plate, prevent that stone bruising. This is the Peregrine from Saucony. We're rounding out this week's vlog from Montreal, we have the Rogue Racer. This is a neutral trail shoe for the serious trail enthusiast. Uh, has a nice, uh, more minimal design than traditional trail shoes, so it really keeps you nice and low to the ground, great step footing. Went out there, has a nice outsole traction with a stone plate, keep you from getting those feet hurt on those rocks. Really keeps the foot nice and blind side uh, when on the trails. This is the Rogue Racer from Montreal. Well, for more info on these items, check out the product pages. Thanks for watching.